up everybody to Demon Back. Welcome to a brand new video. This one is definitely going to be peaking the mic quite a bit. I can guarantee it. Today we're going to be teaching the ninth song from Shin Gojiro. This is one of my favorites from the movie. This is titled Threat aka the appearance of Godzilla from Terror of Mechagodzilla. Now if you guys have seen the channel you know I like Terror of Mechagodzilla quite a bit. I like the music. I've done many piano covers, and echo covers of it. So let's get into the tutorial. I'm going to play it once all the way through and then I'll teach it. <laughs> Godzilla themes for Godzilla mixed into one. I'm going to teach the first one and then I'll teach the second one. So the first one is the one with the build up. You're going to play this, you're going to play two different C's. You're going to play the low octave C's and you're going to play them as fast as you can. You're going to hit them once, give it some time, and then you're going to quickly tap each of them. Try and grow in volume when you do so to make it sound more grand. Once you hit the final peak, you're going to play the main portion of the song. This is Godzilla's main theme, typically throughout the whole series. On the left hand, it is just going to be Fs. C, B, A. You're going to repeat that. Then on the third time it's going to be C, B, A, G flat. And then you're just going to do that C, B, A again. Then you're going to go up, repeat that pattern on the D portion. But instead of hitting a flat, you're going to hit that normal note, which is the A. D twice, C twice, B twice, A. You're going to jump an octave and repeat. So when you put both together, it should sound like this. sound like this. And that's that song. You just completed one whole song. The second one that's played in the movie is more emphasized, and I like this version better. So 
You could do the build up or you could not. I'm going to do it just because I think it's fun. Do exactly what you just did, although hit the notes harder. That's all you got to do to change it up. completed it. It helps on the second time if you hold the chords on the bottom hand for less amount of time instead of if you do. playing this you're gonna hit and there you go so in total both songs together should sound like this <laughs> 